back for a third bite at the apple that is Cyber Manhunt. I think what was the uh what was the what was the mission? It was something about let's give it a sec. It was something about uh hidden eyes or something about uh somebody recording surreptitiously in the shower or something if I remember the cutscene correctly. Not sure. This is going to be the uh, determining factor for me with Cyber Manhunt, um, because as I've mentioned many times before, not to repeat myself, uh, this this could be a really great OSINT game. Um, it is a bad hacking game. It could be a great OSINT game. Uh, I gave it a pass after the tutorial because I felt like it was trying to be a hacking game, and it's bad at that. Uh, but the, the first actual mission after the tutorial, it was more like an OSINT game, and it was doing a decent job at that right up until the very end. Um, so this one is really going to be what determines to me what this game is trying to be, and therefore whether it is a good game or a bad game. Now, to be clear, this is definitely a, a singular opinion. I'm an outlier here. Um, because on Steam... Uh, I'm going to need the audio on, I just realized, okay. On uh, on Steam, uh, overwhelmingly positive. Uh, very positive, over almost 10,000 views. Or uh, 10,000 reviews, rather. So, um, people seem to really like this game. I don't blame people for, for liking it, but if I look at the positive reviews, um, the... Positive reviews basically say, or I'm, and I'm going to paraphrase many thousands of reviews here, uh, says great storyline, very immersive, uh, not a good hacking simulator, but a good puzzle game. And yeah, um, it's not a hacking simulator. It doesn't bill itself as a hacking simulator, by the way. Uh, the description is Cyber Manhunt is a story-oriented puzzle game focusing on big data hacking and so on. So I am judging it not as a hacking simulator, uh, but as a hacking-themed puzzle game, which in my hierarchy of, well, my, my personal hierarchy of, uh, of how I uh, organize these games, a hacking-themed puzzle game is the absolute lowest bar. Um, and uh, that's why I say, you know, at the very end of the first mission we just had, we had to do a quote-unquote, that was our hacking puzzle. And the hacking puzzle amounted to clicking a, an app named Hacking, and then waiting for a password to be generated, then entering that password directly below that into a field, and then clicking something else, and that was about it. So as a, it wasn't it wasn't much of a puzzle in the hacking aspect of it. Um, but as an OSINT puzzle game, it's good. It's a good game. So maybe the difference is just in our terminology, right? Uh, because OSINT, open source intelligence, is not the same thing as hacking. Um, Hacking is a very specific kind of thing. Uh, open source intelligence gathering is a very different kind of thing. Uh, hackers may employ OSINT when they're doing reconnaissance on a potential target, but OSINT is a specific discipline. It's like saying, um, let's see if I can come up with an analog here. Um, it is like... There's got to be a good, good analog for this. Um, okay, it's like you, you have a football team, and the football team is full of specialists, right? You've got your quarterback, you got your special teams, you've got your linebackers, you've got your receivers, and so on. Um, all of them are going to use similar skills in some ways or another, right? Everybody on a football team has to be able to run and has to be able to, you know, handle a ball you know, confidently without dropping it or whatever, regardless of their position, you, you play with a football in football, right? I mean, I even like, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, even your defensive linemen and stuff will, will play with a ball in practice because you have to have ball handling skills, even if it's just not very much. And everybody, even the defensive linemen have to be able to run, even if it's not, even if they don't have to run as well. Um, but comparing OSINT or making OSINT a quote unquote hacking thing is like making running a quarterback thing, right? It's not just a quarterback thing. Running is done by everybody. Some people are just better at it than others, but everybody has to be able to do it. 
Um, so to say that this is like a a a quarterback game because you use OSINT is like saying that you um that this is a football game because you go running. You, you know what I mean? Uh, okay, maybe that wasn't as good an analogy as I thought, but hopefully that made some kind of sense. All right, let's continue where we left off with Poppy Pie and uh, whatever the name of this mission was. Hidden Eyes. Secret Eyes? Yep, I remember this cutscene. There's the camera. And demonetized. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, at least he's looking like he's enjoying himself. I mean, it may be wrong and it may be illegal, but you gotta find joy in life where you can get it. Invisible eyes, of course. Invisible eyes. All right. Now, sadly, that means we're going to get a phone call from Ashley, and we're going to have to talk to her again. It's unfortunate. Yep, there she is. There is a very thorny problem that you need to handle immediately. You know, I haven't even gotten an employment contract from you, Ashley. I haven't seen dime one since I've been working for you, and here you are saying that there's some shit i got to take care of immediately. What is my obligation here, exactly? You think that you can just call me and dump your problems on me and be like, here, you need to take care of this. I don't work for you. According to security surveillance, the head of AI, Tom Branko, broke into the office at 1 a.m. the day before yesterday. The head of AI of Titan? Of your organization? Is that who we're talking about? Is this your guy? Leaked out the encrypted trial data of this important project. Okay. He claimed to have done it under threat, but for privacy reasons, he wouldn't disclose any details. But for privacy reason. You read that wrong. It says reason. He claimed to have done it under threat, but for privacy reason, he won't disclose any details. That does not make any sense. If he's being threatened, he needs to disclose those details to take care of the threat. Right? He's already in hot water. If he doesn't want to be in hot water, then he needs to divulge the details. I suppose he doesn't mind going to jail, huh? Taking the company reputation into consideration, we don't want any media coverage. That's why we need you to investigate the matter. I don't give a fuck about your company's reputation. I have a feeling that your company deserves a little bit of uh, reputational damage. And by the way, this whole company reputation thing, I'm sorry, if your company is doing shit, and if it's shit that if people found out about it, they would think less of you, then that is not a problem that needs to be solved. The problem is that your company is doing shit that if people knew about it, they would suffer reputational damage. The key here is your company shouldn't be doing this shit, not that you should be able to keep it secret. Find out immediately where Tom uploaded the data, and once confirmed, destroy everything. Excuse me? You want me to destroy evidence? Or you want me to destroy the copy that he... Okay. Hmm. I don't feel good about this one. What kind of leads right can you now, give me? All we have is the personal information Tom provided on his first day of work. I will collect it and email it to you. Okay. Remember, act quickly. I feel like you should be calling the police about this. And I, again, I have only one response. Yes, Ashley, whatever you say. The company has completed the acquisition of default. Okay. Oh, really? Our company has completed acquisition of DeFoss, which is the company from the first mission, the guy who killed himself. I'm starting to feel like I am a corporate saboteur. Like I'm being used so that Titan can go around gobbling up other companies. Hmm. I hope the final boss of this game is Titan. It better be. Maybe that's what uh, the DLC Company Man of Titan is about. Give it, all I know about the DLC is the title. Um, and it seems like that would make sense with that title. I fucking hope so. If so, I might just play this to the end just so I get to do that. Uh, DeFoss CTO Daniel Koss will serve as the new CEO and will also head up the newly formed Public Relations Department of Titan. Oh, God. 
but he's in on that shit. We saw those text messages. Um, okay, things are just Blanco. It's doing the fucking thing where it blocks out the whole goddamn screen while it's collecting information for some stupid fucking reason. I really hate that. Okay, that's what we have to go on. All right. Uh, refresh my memory. What are we missing here for uh, for a, a DB search? Uh, well, we pretty much already have everything, don't we? And let's do... Can we do... Nope. Uh, we need DOB. ID number's not in the list. Yeah, this... I don't have access, pseudo I, grep root, blah, blah, blah. This is, we, this is unnecessary. This is not the game's strong suit. Not by a long shot. All right. The, the game's strong suit is OSINT, which means that uh, the browser is really our most important tool. Sadly, the browser is the, uh, the tool in the game that does not work the best. They were, uh, they've got tabs, but they don't work the way that they should. We can't go back. Um, so this is, this is the aspect of the game that the developers should be focusing on making an absolute seamless experience. But it's probably important information here in the news feed. Modi's sister has reported this case to the police accusing Lisa and others of fraud and murder. Okay. After evidence of Lisa cheating emerged, the other members of her team were also exposed. It was reported that Lisa's team has conducted a number of fraudulent marriage schemes. Okay, well, it's good that they got caught. Um, okay. Team Blanco. Uh, that's not going to be relevant. Travel. The cartoon Tom and Jerry, what type of cat is Tom? Why the fuck would this be a result? Well, of course, I can't click on it and see because only relevant pages are actually a thing again this is this is where developers should be focusing should be rounding all this shit out and getting rid of this bleep, 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 let me uh, let me uh, take over all the screen sorry i'm in a weird mood today all right family of four so happy. You haven't changed it. Oh, well. Good negotiating. Oh, a delicious meal. Looks great. Oh, I let it go. Yeah, project I'm responsible for. Uh, 20 years ago, and that's it. Okay. Uh, we have crack. Blanco. Nickname. Telefono. ID number. EOBO. This number. Stop, and also stop having passwords. Just be their last name and then some number. There's real life password lists you could draw from. Just pick one of those randomly. Or something. All right, email. Let's try this. I have received. Tom, well done. I'm very satisfied with the decision to read all the information as a result of the project of games. Hey, come tomorrow morning. Um, the one behind the exertion. Trace leak data, erase data. You need to upload data to... Oh, this should be... Why can't I... Col this is extremely important information. Why can't I collect this? It's got to be all or nothing. Either all relevant information can be clicked on and saved automatically, or none of it should be, and you should give me a 
notepad in game. 24gh3c.com. Oh, that's right. I can't enter URLs directly. Oh, so annoying. This game could be great. I can't search for that. Of course not. Okay. Well, then, uh, this is incredibly information that I cannot collect and make use of right now. So, can I? I can't highlight any of this whole thing. I can't do. Okay. See the people look outside. Oh, there, there. A video file, an indecent photo taken by Spy Karma in a hotel room, in which Tom was with another girl. Contact information. Unknown telephone. May I borrow your cell phone telephone? Some woman named Elise. Tom, 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 Tom. Have you learned nothing from history? Have you learned nothing? Got to keep it in your pants, man. It is the surest and shortest route to ruin. All right. Should we try giving him a call? No? Okay. <clears throat> Sent items. Uh, there's her picture. You'd think I would be able to collect that because this is somebody who's related to the extortion scheme but I can't god this is so uh, you should understand I'm 49 years old and been married to my wife she always thinks I sort of God doesn't know how to be romantic then why are you still with her and together 20 years it's not all you wanted it to be. Change it. Or leave. And honestly, leaving is generally the way to go. Since people don't change that much. Okay, look at this. Failed to send user. Who the hell? God damn it. Who the hell are you? Ah. Oh, God, I'm panicking. All right. Well, that's what we got. Uh, yeah, let's open this. Play that video. Come on. I want to see. Okay. Um, I wonder if that's also his high talk. Oh, we don't have his high talk account yet. Okay. Uh, what do now? Um, one behind the extortion. Maybe I should. Um, oh, I did miss some. I didn't, I don't remember seeing this. Go to. Demandra on business for the 20th thing. Are you Professor Tom? Oh, there we go. Elsie Cameron. Elsie is quite suspicious. Perhaps it's not a coincidence. Someone may have set this up all along. You think? No, come on. Come on. 49 year old professor. People just coming out of the woodwork. It's like being a celebrity, just throwing themselves at you. It's crazy. Keep a close eye on Elsie and keep investigating. So, Ashley, I just want to make sure that I understand this directive correctly. You called me in the middle of an investigation to tell me to keep investigating. Is that what this conversation was about? This is why you picked up the phone? 
Do you have anything to give me? Anything new? Or you're just calling and interrupt me doing my job to tell me to keep doing my job? All right, then. Another wonderful visit from Ashley. Uh, this would be important. She says she's from Alpha University. That may not necessarily be false. Okay. Uh, now can I... No, I can't give her a call, huh? I have her name and telephone number. You'd think that I'd be able to. Um... What did I need? Can I can I use a telephone number in the database? I can. I can, okay. So I can look her up in the super secret hacker database that Titan Industries has for some reason. I totally trust Titan Industries. They definitely seem like they're on the up and up. Everything they do is definitely definitely good. There's no chance that they're evil at all with all the information they have on everybody in the secret database that I have to hack into by pseudoing. Okay, so now we can crack real name. Oh, we don't have a nickname. <clears throat> um, let's search her up. Maybe she's got a toothpick. Elsie's weather forecast. Is that an actual thing? No, it's not. Uh, there it is. LC. I, I knew that that was her goddamn nickname because of the fucking emails, but that's okay. I have to go to the right page and click on the right thing in order to collect it. I hope the education department can replace college math course. Hi, you will need to become a congressman to make it happen. Sad, letting your face. Let's see any pictures. Your body is so hot. I want to spank you so hard. You creep, this is disrespectful towards women. I will report you. Status is private and only accessible to certain friends. That might be a risque photo. I want to see. Uh, can't do uh, fucking white knights again, man. Uh, breakup. I mean, you and Adam Edwards, she has a boyfriend already. Reply Lulu in your dreams. Our idol is going to have a world tour. The first stop is Gaudi. Oh my god, I can't even tolerate Professor Lewis's lecture. I'm so going to fail this semester. Me too. High five, Sophia, at least. Really bored this evening. Do you fancy going for a drink together? No, I don't have time. Archaeologist side is so difficult to choose. See, I'm only half reading these because you don't really have to. Because, I mean, you can't collect anything that's not highlighted anyway. So what's the fucking point in remembering any of this? Uh, 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 high time. Uh, I still think my younger sister is alive, and I still chat with her on High Talk. Unfortunately, she's she will never reply to me again. Oh, okay. Oh, that's sad. That's sad. Uh, okay, nickname. Telephone. May I borrow your cell phone telephone? Hey, it's not just her last name. And then some random numbers. All right, do I have email? I have no email. I have high talk, though. Yes. To the top. Honey, your recent state is very worrying. You look haggard. If you encounter any problem, don't worry. I will solve it. What? That's so unnatural. Well, if you need help, you can tell me anytime. Thank you, Sophia. That's so unnatural. Is she a bot? <laughs> oh my god. Hey, baby, you know how much I miss your body? Thinking of your tearful begging expression excites me. I have time tomorrow. See you at the same place. I'm waiting for you, baby. 
How about something exciting? Wow. Now, the hill behind the forest park. Haha, ha, you slutty little bitch. I like this proposal. What the fuck? <laughs> I just saw the note. At least, uh, Elsie's conversation with Chameleon seems flirtatious. You fucking think? Flirtatious. Flirtatious implies at least a measure of subtlety. This is just like fucking. <laughs> Lulu already told me. Where did you see those videos? How dare you did? How dare? How dare you did not tell me anything and treated me like a joke? Hey, calm down first. We just don't want to damage your self-esteem. You're lying. You guys are spreading the video. This will kill me. Okay, sorry. I admit it was wrong. Where did you see it? A porn site. You won't find the uploader. No one will know except the uploader himself. Tomorrow is Adam's nineteenth birthday. Are you going to? How did I get his picture? Did I miss something? Are you going to High's party? No. Did you really break up? Hasn't he been good to you? Who broke up with whom? Lulu, it's late. I have to go to bed. You are so boring. Elsie, is this person you? A picture. A naughty picture. Where did you see it? From Zio. He actually told me that almost all the boys in the class have seen your naked body a week ago. Oh my god, you're so slutty. Uh, I can't believe you would do such things. Like, what things? Like, the pictures are just, in general, not being completely asexual. Um, I suppose you're mysterious. You break up with Adam because of this. Okay. Cinderella casting, audition schedule, blah, blah, blah. I'll see your blonde hair is very beautiful. I would like to invite you to audition for the role of Cinderella. Are you free tomorrow? Sorry, I'm in no condition to audition lately. Many time. Mr. Connor. Elsie, you don't look very good. Why are people always messaging her to tell her she looks like shit? Are you ill? Sorry to make you worry. I think I had a cold in the past few weeks. Yes, you don't look well. I will get better soon. I heard some news about you and your boyfriend. However, I suggest that you get in shape as soon as possible. After all, you came to this university to study. Yes, I will. Thank you. I admit when I first, they had me in the first half. Not going to lie. I thought that was going in a different direction. Okay. Elsie Cameron. Hello. Hello, who are you? How do you know my name? Promiscuous girl. Ha ha ha. I like your busty boobs. Could you send me the underwear you wore? It must smell really good. Yeah, fucking gross. You pervert. I will call the police. Your temper's nasty, you goddamn bitch. Well, I've seen worse exchanges on Reddit. All right. Uh, this is her sister she was talking about communicating with. Dear, maybe you fell asleep peacefully in the kingdom of God. I don't want to disturb you, but there is no one for me to turn to. I want to share a happy life with you, but now I feel like I'm in hell. I met the devil and made a deal with him. He's torturing my body and my mind. I can't talk to anyone. I occasionally write a diary on my cell phone, which is a thing we can collect because we have her cell phone, I guess. But I was afraid of being seen by others. I can't even say too much to you. How could I defile your purity? If you are still alive, you definitely don't want to see such a sister. I am so sad. Well, I'm not going to judge you. Dear, I really want to see Barbie Saya's world tour. Okay, why am I collecting this? Everyone seems to be... Mobile phone diary? Maybe we could hack into his phone through phishing and check out the diary. You are so late on this. Also, his phone? Through... Check out this. Is... I believe her pronouns are she, her. I haven't seen confirmation of this, I suppose, but that seems to be the case. Um, okay, whatever. I, I knew you were going to say that. I was, I, I mean, I was afraid you were going to say that, I should say. But also, you're late. I found that clue, like, fucking ages ago. Uh, okay, this is Adam. This is her ex-boyfriend. Uh, yep, he found the video. We're collecting the most inane things and ignoring the most important things. This is really fucking weird. This highlighting mechanic doesn't... It doesn't work. It could work. 
It doesn't work the way it is right now. So lean into it or dump it. Can't You can't do this both thing. All right. And we didn't need to collect this. This was this was pretty self-evident. All we needed to do is see this exchange. We didn't have to collect, well, whatever. Okay, I'm not, not going to... Not going to be picky, I guess. Um, let's see. Um, oh, do we need to do the hacking thing? Yes. Oh, God. This is stupid. <sighs> hacking into a phone is not a simple task. True, but I have a feeling you're going to make it really easy. A Trojan tool needs to be installed on the target's phone, but he is not an idiot. Why would he let you install an unknown software? Again, with he. Are we are we hacking Adam or Elsie? It's I thought it was Elsie. Why are we saying he? That's why embedding the remote tool into the phishing link is the simplest method. Courtesy of Titan's powerful system, the creation of the phishing link is quite easy. Embedding the remote tool into the phishing link is the simplest method. <sighs> Embedding the remote tool into the phishing link. Okay, so you send someone a phishing message. It contains a link to malware. They click the link, they download the malware, they execute the malware, the malware is running, the malware provides a backdoor. Okay, that's how this is supposed to work. Embedding the remote tool in the phishing link implies that the link itself is malware. As in, they click the link, and then somehow, instead of downloading malware, clicking the link alone, executes the malware as in the link itself is this doesn't make any sense am i just supposed to just say oh well titan's got a powerful system which allows for this to happen because if that's the case this game should be about taking down titan because that is insane <laughs> and if such a thing were possible like with I mean, we're talking like NSA level exploits here. You should not have them as a private company. You just shouldn't. I don't care if you are a government contractor. I don't care if you are the government. You should not have this kind of power. Now, try to remember what kind of things the target is interested in. Then send the target a phishing link. This is what I'm talking about when I, when I say that the hacking aspect of this game is the absolute weakest. Like, as a hacking. As a hacking simulator, it's not one. As a hacking puzzle game, it's the puzzles are too easy to be considered a, a hacking puzzle game. But all of the hacking aesthetics and trappings and presentation and everything just fall flat. Get a, lean away from the hacking aspect of this. I'm not saying do away with it completely, because here and there it could be an interesting occasional puzzle. But this shit doesn't make any sense. You, you, you gotta dump this stuff. The target may report on you if too many phishing links are sent out, so you only have one chance. I only have wisely. one chance. I that also doesn't make any sense. Cats giving to the needy is that what that's supposed to be? Um, romance singing. I don't remember seeing anything about a cat. Um, I mean, she did seem like a bit of a romantic, but she did just break up with her boyfriend, so this seems like a bad idea. She did seem like she wanted to perform, but wasn't in a place to audition, so... And I don't remember seeing anything about giving you the meeting, so I'm gonna go with this one. Uh, and the, the pseudo code here that we get to see that makes it look all hackery and everything. Just based on what I was... Just send it out to the target as soon as you are ready. Then we just wait for the target to fall for the phishing. Uh, based on what I'm able to see from the pseudocode that they have running, it doesn't 
Enter the target's phone number to send it out. Mean anything. One more thing. We don't just install a remote tool on the target's phone. Oh, really? What else do you do? A Trojan will also be installed. Once the hacking is successful, all of the target's call history will be emailed to you. <laughs> Pay attention to the email, as it may provide critical clues. Email, the best way to exfiltrate information. The best way. When, when you gain unauthorized access to a system, the absolute best thing to do is to send yourself an email directly to your personal, uh, real, corporate email address. That's what you want to do. Send that email direct to yourself. No one will ever be able to trace it. Remember, the window is very small. You need to find out all the clues before... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm still unclear as to who we're supposed to be doing this to, because I thought we were doing it with Elsie. That's her picture. But they keep saying he. I don't know. Sending vision email. Okay, let's look at the pseudocode. Let's see what this is. Uh, assigned key length. Uh, uh, it's going by too fast. It's gibberish. Okay, successfully. Implantation successful. There's three to do. Okay, photos. My idol. Shits. I don't know who that is. Let's go to the diary first. We know that's where some information is. Oh, shit. Fuck. I don't know what that is either. I meet. Damn it, we need to crack this too. I'm starting to take it back because this actually is a fun puzzle. Uh, oh, can't crack such software. Okay. Like, it, it, this, I mean, this is some, you know, aesthetic hacking, aesthetic type stuff. Um, but, uh, this is, this is way more variety and way more fun uh, uh, variety of puzzle challenges than anything else in the game so far. I'm just sad that I had to wait until mission two to be able to do this. Um, okay. Oh, shit. Password hint my idle no data. Okay. Damn. Okay. Uh, my idol. Oh, fuck. Okay. Shit. Who was her idol? Um, Oh, she wanted to see the, uh, uh, the, uh, singer. <clears throat> Is that her idol? Do I have to do the whole name? No? Okay. Um. Shit. Um. I thought that would be it. I thought for sure it was going to be the singer. Does it have to be capitalized? Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. That's, no, that's unfair. That's shit. A horrible math class. Okay. Selfie. Performance. Okay, this is, this is cool. These attributes are cool. Today we are, we are together today. Today we are finally. Rainbow never tells me that a gust and storm are by, yet she is more convincing than philosophy. <coughs> Roy G. Biv. Red, orange, yellow, green. Is that supposed to be her unlock pattern? 
Uh, no data. I don't want to look cute. Okay. Is that supposed to be her unlock pattern? Is it? Yes, yes it is. Okay. Diary. Miranda passed away today. Okay. I'm trying to be fast because I don't think we have a lot of time. This bar is depleting fast. Uh, it's supposed to be kind of slave. John controlled Elsie with his threats. Uh, he's like a mad dog biting me over and over. He threatened me in order to spend a night with another stranger. I refused and he sent Adam the video of what he did. Okay, there's one more piece of information here that I'm missing. Um, shit. <clears throat> um, I can't remember if there was another thing to unlock. No, I able to. Thought there was. Oh, this one. Set up car brake system failure. Oh my god. Horn X V I P Tom Long Sunflower in. Barbie say, yeah. I mean, she was looking for the video of her. She was looking for Tom. Target has lost interest. Oh, shit. Okay, let's get out of here. That was three of three. Okay. Oh, my God. Um. All right, so. What I just did, that was a good hacking puzzle game. It's not a hacking simulator. But it was a good hacking puzzle game. Because there were interesting, various, a variety of interesting puzzles with a technology or hacking aesthetic that worked. I don't know why I had to wait until the second mission to do something like that, but that worked. Whereas the other ones definitely did not. They were way too easy. You asked me to just enter in a number, or enter in a password. That was directly above the thing, uh, the entry input um, uh, cell field. Um, that worked. The other ones didn't. Um, that isn't necessarily, I'm not necessarily saying, okay, now the hacking thing is working for me. I still see this as primarily an OSINT investigation game, and I still think you'd be better off leaning into that, but that was an example of doing it right. Right there. All right. Um, um, so anyway, um, Warn X VIP, is that what we're supposed to be searching for next? No. Uh, what else was on there? Uh, there was something called the Sunflower Inn. I saw she looked for the video of herself on the porn website. I saw she looked for Tom Blanco, but there was something called the Sunflower Inn, and I, and she mentioned going to a hotel before. So that's probably where they went. And John. John is the one who was extorting her. Or whatever. The actual owner of the hotel was behind this, huh? Why the hell would he do that, I wonder? Is that all we got? System maintenance, can't book now. The mark of any good hotel. You can't make reservations. Okay. Uh, oh, let's, let's see. We got his name now. John Thompson's toothbook. Cool. 
Golden fall, the season of the year for romantic dates and lovers. Welcome to the Sunflower Inn. Couples will enjoy a 22% discount. Perhaps my passion is... want to open a tattoo parlor. Okay. That's an odd ambition for a hotelier, but okay. I think everyone is more than meets the eye. They are never just what we see on the outside. You don't understand the complexity of human beings. Everyone has a, a chameleon. We know chameleon. Is it the same? I can't get a bigger view of the profile picture, but it looks the same to me. Neck tattoo. Okay. Nothing in the world is like it. I'm sorry to break it to you, dude, but that looks like a pretty... That's just a tribal design. It definitely is out there somewhere, I guarantee it. I mean, chameleons aren't very common, but it's just a tribal chameleon. Uh, sunflowers with the bloom. Who cares? You're a fucking man. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 Okay, enough with the 22% discount. I get it. I get it. Okay. Why can't I have his... Uh, I should be able to record his screen name. I know what his nickname is. It's Chameleon. Um, pull phone. No, I need his actual personal telephone. We don't have a high talk account. We don't have a DOB. Mail, house number, telephone number. We need his real telephone number, okay? <clears throat> okay. Um What do now? I never had a loss here. Um, oh, we never did a search for Adam, did we? Is he a musician? No. Okay. Uh, he's not Adam Modern. Here's Adam. Is that his toothbook? Uh, yeah. Concert tour is coming soon, but the people who would uh, go with me is gone. What? You broke up. What happened? I made a lovely breakfast for my little peach. Oh, little kitty. So cute. No, you're cuter. Oh my god. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> We've been together for exactly one month. So uh eight four twenty one is when they began their relationship. Helping homeless people, charity may have been the beginning, but uh okay, so he's the one who's helping the homeless people. I need to hack into his you know phone or whatever. Um, but that doesn't really, uh, uh, get me very much. Um, let's see. I think I have enough now. I can do his, yeah, I can do this. I have his DOB. Hmm. <sighs> Ha <laughs> ha. 
<coughs> and do I have enough now to do this? Yes, here. Name. Tell. ID. DOB. And house number. Honestly, the, the database really kind of kind of makes things um really easy. Eh, I'm not, I guess I'm not complaining. I guess, I guess. I don't know. Could be better. No, it's not at least it's not his last name plus a random number. It is his first two first. So. All right, can I get into his high talk now? I can't. Bunk. I'm afraid the whole world knows that your ex-girlfriend is a bitch enough. Please don't mention again. Okay, I feel sorry for you. Don't expect to be such a promiscuous woman. Uh, I just want to stay away from my high talk as being borrowed with Mr. Okay. Poor Adam. What was it about her that attracted you in the first place? She may have a pretty face, but she is really a slut. Uh, that's what's... Uh, Lulu's in on this. Lulu wants some of that Adam. Frederic. <laughs> Look at how furious you are. Everyone in this game talks like an anime character. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> All right, Zio, bro. Um, okay. There was nothing to collect here, so I'm not sure what the point of any of that was. Um. Oh God, am I what, am I missing something? It says here I got eighty eight percent on this one. So I feel like there should have been something else to collect here, but I guess not. Oh, sunflower and call. Okay. Um let's do it. Subscribe your dialed is busy now. Okay. Let's try again. Okay. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong, the whole fishing um, LC thing with the embedded malware or whatever was a stupid, flimsy uh, plot device. But um, if we had simply fished her and she fell for a fish and downloaded malware, uh, then otherwise the premise was fine. I don't know. I'm kind of bouncing around here because I'm thinking about all the things that I've been, I've found and have gone through in order to figure out what the hell I could possibly be fucking missing. I can't call the sunflower in. Um, well, Elsie is on, or Elise is on iMeet. We did see that. She has iMeet on her phone. Um, is it possible that. But the site is still here. Uh, am I getting your name wrong? I don't think so. No? Okay. Okay. Well, the site is still here. It would have been cool if we could find her profile, too. Because uh, we know she's on iMeet game this would be a good example of where you could throw in other sites that don't necessarily provide answers but provide verisimilitude to the scenarios this would be a perfect example of that we saw that she's on iMeet she has the app she has a profile we should be able to see it even if it has nothing to do with the scenario okay Oh, that's right. Um, uh, hold on a sec. I just remembered that uh, Ashley did have some useful information. She said that 
uh, it would send an email to us uh, after the hack. It didn't, though. There's nothing here. Okay. Should I have gotten something and I didn't? Uh, or is it under... Well, that was Tom's email. No, okay. Ah. Kind of stuck. I feel like I'm missing a key piece of information, and I'm not sure where to get it. Go back through Elsie's high talk. Um, let's try searching for million. No, I didn't think so. Mm -hmm. let's okay hold on let's let's think it through um oh um oh hold on i just thought of something um elsie had some private posts right there was that photo at least yeah. Um uh uh certain friends. So Adam, right? Adam certainly would be on that list. Uh login toothbook password. No. Can we log in as Elsie herself? Yes, we can. Okay, 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 okay. Can't such a, you know, there's nothing I could do about it. I was angry and ashamed at my cowardly behavior. I wanted to end my life yet. I think my sister has passed away. I can't let anything happen to myself. My parents would be heartbroken. I woke up from a nightmare last night and I kept crying. Maybe I was possessed by the devil because I slipped my wrist open. Luckily, the pain woke me up. I can't just die like this. Sophia saw my wound today and I had to lie and say it was an accident. No matter what I'm experiencing, I don't want people who love me to worry. I hope I can become stronger. Okay. 97. Okay. I wish I could. Now I'm going to the sunflower. Well, we already saw that in her search history on her phone. But 
That's apparently not the last clue. Okay. Uh. Oh, that's where the idle comment. Um, that's how I should have known that. I mean, I did figure it out because I remember seeing the thing on the other thing, but. Shit, what else am I missing? I thought for sure um, that would be that. Um, did. I wish I could go back. Just let me go back, man. Just let me go back. Acute peach, Jesus Christ. Okay. Um, how about Tom? Did he have anything on his suit book that we couldn't see? I don't remember. I don't think so. Tom. Not that I can see. Well, we're ninety seven percent of the way there. Can we can we do the reasoning early? Well, looks like we can. Uh oh, there's the homeless charity project. Hold on, let's search for that. Because um, oops, Adam Adam was into that. No, okay. Oh, Adam is into music. So maybe uh, we did try this. It didn't work. Yeah, Lulu is jealous of them and probably responsible for this in some way. Hmm. Just going back here to see if there's any other... Clues. Say, uh, rainbow colors. She had to Google what is the order of the rainbow colors. I still feel like this should be a clue to to look. Um, Threatened me in order to spend the night with another stranger. I refused, and he sent Adam a video of what I did under threat. Adam was so hurt and disappointed with me. He said he wanted to break up, and I didn't even have time to tell him what happened. Everything in front of my eyes is dark. I can't see any of the light. I'm sorry. You don't really have much of an excuse here. I mean, you did what you did, you know? An advertisement picture. Oh, that gives me a clue to what I'm missing. Shit, I wish I... Well, I don't think I've actually needed it before, because the things that I was missing before didn't seem to be necessary to solve. Whatever, but an advertisement picture. Okay, that helps some, I think. Let's 
Uh, it's not that. It's not that. And that's not that. That's from from before. <clears throat> uh, what other advertisement picture could they possibly be referring to? I guess let's go back over to some of the places. The Sunflower Inn. Was there an advertisement on there? There's. A Oh, yeah. This. The bed from the picture. Yeah, that makes sense. With oh. enough leads now, the whole picture is becoming more clear. Let's try to make some inference and see what conclusion we can draw. Let's, as in let us? You haven't done a fucking thing in this investigation except call me and waste my time. How about I make some inferences and you shut the fuck up? All right, uh, drag the character into the upper space. Is this all the people who are supposed to have been involved with her? Well, Adam, his boyfriend. We know the chameleon was hitting that, and Tom, I think. Um. Not acquainted? I suppose they were getting to know each other. Um, where ha has the, uh, John Soothbuck? Yeah, there. We don't have to do this. We can see that they're the same. John is ahead of the sun. He appeared in Elsie's diary at Elsie at a fundraising event for the homeless. Um, of course, Elsie to be a slave, according to her. Also forced her to go to bed with another man. We, uh, so, I guess that one is... Well, oh, check all. Okay. Um, I don't remember where they met. Um, nope. Tom's marriage or anything about it. I'll see... Uh, the man also recorded many videos and took pictures. He has forced me to become his slave. I regret it all so much. Why did I see him alone? I should have told Adam about this. Now my body is full of injuries. I can't face the future anymore. What should I do? I mean, you seemed thrilled on high talk to meet with him, so... Uh... Cry for help, maybe. I don't know if that's... Attempted suicide, but definitely a cry for help. Um, I don't think they met at a charity event. Maybe wrong. What? That's both true. What? What? These are definitely both true. John is the head of the Sunflower Inn. He appeared in Elsie's diary. It says right here that she felt forced to become his slave. What am I... Uh, what? What am I missing here? It seems like I'm supposed to check off the ones that are true. Okay. Oh, okay. That uh, this one I didn't see. Um because I didn't see anything about that. I'm not sure where I was supposed to get that. Uh Oh, is that what this is supposed to imply? Okay. That makes sense. Uh, and the man whom John wanted also to seduce is most likely to be Tom. And the person who emailed Tom and wanted to steal the data is John. Tom wanted to obtain the information.
great job. John was the one who sent an anonymous email to Tom. Yeah, we didn't need to do that whole thing to figure that out. That was pretty apparent. He had installed spy cameras ahead of time at the Sunflower Inn. He captured everything indecent Elsie did with her boyfriend so as to have her under his control. He did? That's not at all what the evidence has been saying. It seems more like Elsie did plan on cheating on her boyfriend with the chameleon, but instead changed her mind or was otherwise raped and had images of the incident recorded, and then they were used as leverage to get her to do other things with other guys. And then that was used to get Tom to provide the AI information to John. That's the story that we have. I don't... I don't understand what the fuck you're talking about here. And he instructed Elsie to seduce and extort, but yeah. why would he want our project data? It's very suspicious. You're very suspicious. Lock on to John. Keep investigating him. Ashley, I'm going to say this one more time. If you waste another moment of my time by calling me in the middle of my job to tell me to keep doing my job, I'm going to tighten and I'm cutting your fucking head off. Let's try calling the Sunflower Inn. See if we can get John's contact information out of them. We already knew this, too. Um, now we can probably call, huh? Now it's no longer busy. Hello, this is Sunflower Inn. I'm happy to be at your service. Hello, this is Sunflower Inn. Mr. Thompson is the person to speak to, but he isn't here right now. Is there anything else I can do to assist you? <clears throat> Impersonating a member of the Consumer Council. It would help if you could tell us the last name of the guest, which we can look up in the check-in records. Who's Darlene Perry? I don't remember Darlene Perry. Sorry, sir, but we can't find the record. Passengers have always been very satisfied with our service. Passengers? Are you sure you haven't made a mistake? Passengers? Sorry, but right now we're receiving a high number of calls that need to be taken. Oh, shut up. Unfortunately, the anonymous call. Yeah, try another call. Hello, this is Sunflower Inn. I'm happy to be at your service. Ow, 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 ow. Foot cramp, foot cramp, foot cramp, ow. Mr. Thompson is the person to speak to, but he isn't here right now. Is there anything else I can do to assist you? It would help if you could tell us the last name of the guest, which we can look up in the check-in records. I don't know who Darlene Perry is. I guess it must be Elsie. Sorry, sir, but we can't find the record. Really? Passengers have always been very satisfied with our service. Passengers. It's... Are you sure you haven't made a mistake? Sorry, but right now we're res Shut up. <sighs> oh. There's Darlene Perry. I stayed at this hotel on October 11th and lost something there the next day. This hotel isn't very good. I will complain to the Consumer Council. Oh, okay. Well, it makes a lot of sense after you see that. I guess I didn't pay attention. Uh, no, uh, that's Dirty Pool. 
that's dirty pool. There's 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 absolutely nothing to indicate that this would yeah. No, I I'm sorry, game. That's dirty pool. I don't appreciate it. I'm not taking I'm not taking the L on that one. This one's on you. Can you please just hurry up, because honestly it pretty would help if you could tell us the last Miss Darwin Perry contacted what is us. The check -in time and date? October eleventh. Please wait a moment. Uh, we do in fact have this record. We already received feedback from this customer, and we are currently doing everything we can to resolve the issue. By the way, hotel guests are not known as passengers. That doesn't make any sense. Passenger implies that they are traveling. Like, using it as a conveyance to travel. And last time I checked, hotels don't fly, or ride, or slide, or walk, or whatever. Um, I checked it, blah, 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 blah. Please confirm. Your tells us Uh, sure, no problem. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Okay. We got his phone number now. Now we can call him. No, no problems. But now we can do... Uh, did we already do that? Yeah, now we can do this. stuff now hooray we used the super scary database of titan titan's definitely not the bad guys um we have we should totally his his nickname is totally chameleon i don't know why it won't let us do it let's, let's try it anyway Telephone number. ID number. POV. House number. Melio. Seems to have worked. All right, uh, we got toothbrush and we got um, high talk. We got email. Let's try high talk. Yeah, okay. Uh, same conversation, baby. You taste so sweet. I can't wait to lick you all over. Remember, don't ignore me, otherwise, I'll be angry. Do you understand what the consequences will be? I got a very clear shot of you enjoying it. You simply could not resist the pleasure. You ugly creep. The police will get you. The police will not. I can do a lot of things like this, and no one will dare touch me. You know why? I already taught a lesson to the slaves who wanted to put up a fight. Their lives are now over. All those who know them will only remember them as sluts. You don't want that. Of course, some people tried calling the police. But I'm still fine. Why? You don't need to know so much, otherwise you won't live long. I'm not bluffing. You better obey my words and be my slave. If I tell you to bark, you will bark with a wagging tail. Don't do anything silly, otherwise you'll be as miserable as those slaves who fought against me. I will send your naked photos and sex videos to your boyfriend, your family, your school's website, your teacher's mailbox, and all the places where you are afraid to appear in. These people will see you from top to bottom, and they will treat you as an object of fantasy. You're a pervert. Thank you for the compliment. You're so cute and you're angry. I hope I'll see you again tomorrow. You must come. Understand. There's the video. Otherwise, this video will be released tomorrow. Be good, okay, my cute little slave. Uh, you do something for me, you know, Tom Blanco. Why? See, this is Chameleon. This is Tom's messages to Elsie. Why would Elsie have deleted this conversation? Why would she have done that? It doesn't make any sense. Why, why would he send this to her over high talk, where it would be recorded? And then why would she get rid of the evidence and why would he not get rid of it? If anything, we should just be seeing, we should be seeing this in Elsie's view and Elsie's in this view. 
in your dreams, damn bitch, you're, you're disgusting, you gotta do some things in the video, to, yeah, that little bitch, I gave you, the, uh, I said, don't, no idea what to do, uh, of course I'll help you, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so hey, you know, is a, you know, I have done around so you know, there's a way for you to, let her to do something extreme. Okay, so this this is the part where we get to see this is what she saved for some reason. Here's the link. I found you through high tox people nearby function on my phone. I encountered a psycho. Can you help me? Okay. This is the one of the other ones he was talking about. So he keeps people as literal prisoners, but allows them to keep their phones. This is his captive texting him to let her go. Um, it's charging admission to the site. Okay. This seems like it would be important information to capture. It's a name of one of his former victims, but the game is not having us do that. All right, that's high talk. Does this get us into his email too? does all right uh let's start at the bottom this time dear john thompson this is you right i know you are one of the administrators of porn x vip your code name is chameleon i'm not here to threaten uh, in fact i quite admire your skill you can call me van Where are the dirty things you do at your hotel? You use spy cameras to make decent videos of female cameras and threaten to serve them. Uh, we'll see the sent version or the sent reply in a moment because they don't have the email chains here. They just have emails and then sent. Uh, I need to obtain the data as project. Van, Van is the one who really wanted the information. We need the password. Let's see if he actually listened. Well, this email appears to be quite important. Let's not try anything until the password is confirmed. How do you propose we confirm the password without trying it? Maybe go look up more clues. Good advice, Ashley. I hadn't thought of that. That's why you're in charge around here. That's why you're the boss.
Okay, no trash. I can see this. You made the right choice. Let Tom Blanco transfer the project. I can see the first line of the email, even though it's encrypted. This email appears to be quite... Maybe go look up more... Are you going to say that every time I click on that? This email appears... Maybe go look up more... I have gained the power to summon Ashley at will. Yes, this Ashley. Email appears to be, maybe go I can do this clues. all day. I can do this, this all day, Ashley. Up. Every second that I've summoned you here before this me is a second you're not bothering somebody clues. else. Oh, yes. This Going mad appears, with the power. <laughs> okay, I'm getting annoyed. Uh, uh, let's see. Uh, uh. Okay. Um, go back to his high talk because he was talking to um, Zachary about this transaction and I didn't really pay attention to it at first, but maybe he, oops, I, hold on, high talk, copy there, paste there, copy there, paste there. Um, but maybe he mentioned it to him. Um, or wait, was it? Oh, um, oh, that's right. The browser won't allow me to just enter in fucking URLs for some stupid ass reason. Like it's a fucking browser. It's a browser. I should be able to do that. It's like the basic thing browsers can do. Been able to do that since before there was a. Go, go. No, we can't. Okay. Uh, it wasn't Zachary. It was somebody else. Um, um, something more valuable in an entire database. It's a huge one. Uh, I have access to the names. I just press the control. Okay. All right, never mind. Um, He must have shared the password with somebody. That's the only way we're going to be able to get it, right? Where is that in here? Oh, here we go. Oh, I have to access it from the thing. That's stupid. So let me type the fucking thing in. Oh my god. Uh, forum rules. This is cool, by the way. Like, the verisimilitude, again, on display in this game. But it does highlight the shortcomings with this game, too. This is cool, but in order to do this, I had to go through the stupid UI and launch it, because you can't just click and enter a url like it's a perfectly good example of the the bad part of this game and the good part of this game it's a perfect juxtaposition of the two things right next to each other there is a porn site with forums in an investigation into human trafficking and i can't enter a url to get there i have to go through the stupid ui perfect example fucking sandwich of the good and bad that is this game
Okay, we got posts from Chameleon. Oh, uh, shit, there's a lot here, too. Fuck. Okay, let's start at the top. Let's read them form rules. We don't want to accidentally... There's a high talk number here. Who's this supposed to be for? Uh, Fallen Angel. Who's Fallen Angel? We know too little about the person known as Fallen Angel. Go search his high talk using the browser. Hopefully we can find something unexpected. Fuck, Ashley, seriously? You're... <laughs> I wish Ashley was real so I could walk over to her and slap her. Okay, and I can't, there's no back button. It opens everything in a new fucking tech. Oh, there's so many things about this game that are so frustrating. I want to like it so much. Uh, AD 2002. Adam's in on this? Huh. Honestly didn't expect that. Is it going to say that for all of us? Yeah. I need an invitation code. Or I'm guessing that it's just walling these off um, in order to avoid having to, you know, create all this unnecessary content for the scenarios. But guys, with, what is it, Aruba Studios? What the fuck is that? Uh, Aluba. Uh, with Aluba Studios, guys. I know that making games is hard and putting content in that doesn't directly relate to the scenarios is a lot of work that ultimately amounts to nothing because it's not necessary to complete the objectives. But I'm telling you, all of this extra stuff matters. It adds, it adds to the scenario. It makes them more real and it makes them harder because there's irrelevant information that acts as red herrings in it. So I understand that it seems counterintuitive creating content that ultimately is irrelevant to the scenarios but that is what is that is what makes them good um wow adam's in on this that's uh all right um well ashley told us to search the high talk i, I don't think we've ever actually searched a high talk before is that a thing no okay oh wait it was sorry it was the wrong high talk Maybe it only works with the right high talk. It does only work with the high, right high talk. CV of Gu Chen, top private investigator. Why would that be on Wikipedia? Are people putting their CVs on Wikipedia now? Uh, meet True Love now, Mason Tooney. What? I know that name. Investigator born in uh, Chongqing, China. Immigrated to... Uh, and then it gets cut off. Specialization in hacker technology and social engineering. We'll take care of business without leaving the house. Extreme social anxiety, committed homebody, prefers solitude. <laughs> uh, find out more. Check out Indie Puzzle Game Keyword and see. It's another advertisement for that other game, but this is hilarious. I'm a private investigator, but I don't like to leave my house. Or talk to anybody. <laughs> That's funny. All right, this is the one we're looking for because Mason is that guy. Mason's that guy from before, I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, that's his high talk. Okay. 
Okay, we're just here for his name, I guess. Um, okay. Uh, well, let's search for the name, I guess. Some Toonie Toothbook. That's the guy. I like fairy. <laughs> I like fairy tales very much because they're beautiful and innocent. Look, I've been running around the University Drama Club. Uh, yeah, this is the guy from before who was messaging her about being Cinderella. So, uh, Beauty and the Beast. Uh, continue my role as president of the drama club, which we are collecting this here for some reason, even though he said it in the first post, so we already knew that. Uh, also doing the homeless people thing. Okay. Do you have anything else? Just the I meet, which we already had. Okay, um, and we have his name, we have his high talk account, okay. And that means that we have his name, he has ID number, and his DOB, DOB, and his house number, telephone, uh, and his nickname, we don't have in the list, but we know it from the thing and it this this worked before with the chameleon so i'm guessing it'll work now i don't know if i was supposed to click it and collect it or what but i didn't it's not on the list but that's okay the fact that it works without us <clears throat> knowing it okay we're still we went from using name and then number to initials and number and i'm tired of the patterns okay people don't do this it's not the way passwords uh work um if you look at the the um slash dot or, or any other collection of common passwords as provided from password leaks, you'll see that the, the list of the top 20 passwords has changed virtually none in like the 15 years they've been collecting this data. And almost none of them are people's individual names and, uh, and numbers. Okay, it's, it's the same shit over and over again. Um, all right, we, we don't have an email address. We do have high talk. So we can switch user here, go here, copy here, go there, do this, go here, copy, and then paste, and then do this, and then we're in, and then now we do the hacker voice, and then here we go. Group chat. All right. Creeping on some people, I see. You're part of the part of the ring. When can you bring the person to the solution? Group chat. Okay. Are we going to get the thing here? We've on some people and maybe six videos and seven blah 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 blah. So you have thousands of people. And then I go, I can't take it anymore. Don't you enjoy it too? Do you want to oh, please don't do that? Dude, just let the just just leave. Let people see the fucking videos. You really think I mean I understand the damage to your reputation in the short term is terrifying but that would mean that these people are spreading evidence of their crimes to the public do you really think that's that's good for them in the long run i mean take the short-term l for the long-term win all right this is before when the, the talking to her about the thing i mean i've never been in this position so it's easy for me to say but i can tell you as a computer criminologist that in the long run people that have done this kind of thing and then actually released the information, they almost never actually win in the end because they are spreading evidence of their crimes. And there have been several cases very recently in terms of revenge porn or something like that, 
uh, where they have gone down in flames over the, the thing. Um, and if you think that just acquiescing and going along with it means that they will keep your secret, they won't. Uh, Mason, can you help me? What's wrong? Do you need money? I heard you are dating the most beautiful girl among the Frenchmen. The Freshmen. <laughs> the Frenchmen. The most beautiful girl among the Frenchmen. Not uh, bad, kid. Um, I want to go to Barbie Say's concert with her, but the only, but only the expensive VIP tickets are for sale for purchase. So, how much do you want? I know you're loaded. This two thousand euros, okay? Made some money recently, and I can lend it to you at first. When are you going to pay me back? I will ask the family to increase my allowance every month and try to pay it back within half a year. Deal. Come find me at my door. And pay me back the money you owe me immediately. This is not the deal we agreed six months, but it's only been one month. Although the concert has not happened yet, I already reserved my tickets. I urgently need the money. Just return the tickets and get a refund as compensation. I have a gift for you. I will pay for a trip to the most famous senior cruiser. This is a weird conversation they're having. This is so dumb. Uh, uh, is this when she decided, he decides to go on the... Uh, forums and post it it's weird that we didn't see this in in adam's chats he must have deleted the conversation like we already knew this we already knew this it's the same fucking thing God, everyone in this game talks like an anime character. It's terrible. <laughs> oh, hold on a sec. I noticed this before, but I didn't uh, think anything of it at the time. I mean, I didn't think it was going to be meaningful at the time, I guess I should say. But yes, I noticed this before. We'll grab it at the end here. Uh, you... Yes, there are more than 20 hotels that provide me with resources. Jesus. Drama club. Let me guess. Changing in the... Uh... Oh, no. And drugs, too. <laughs> Those damn hackers. Again, if we weren't hackers, this game would... Ah, whatever. It's fine. Uh, uh, okay, come on. Doesn't that line of symbols in John's chat history look familiar to you, too? I literally just said that. Try to remember where you have seen these symbols and begin the second round of inference. I believe the answer is within our grasp. You are about as useful as an asshole on your elbow. Did you know that, Ashley? Get the fuck out of here. God damn you. All right. Uh, so... W E L C O M E space T O space P O R N X V I P exclamation point W N I'm gonna I'm actually gonna write this down because there's no notepad in the game, so I have to write like a fucking caveman using a pencil and paper. And I'm, I'm, I'm kidding, I'm not really that upset by having to Right, W N M O X um, T C Is that supposed to be E?
Based on the clues we obtained, who instructed John to steal the AI project that was Van? And the encrypted email that Van sent to John is likely to hide the following information. Uh, it's going to contain Tom's private information. Right? No? Is it the server? Yeah. The password of this encrypted email is probably related to the uh, porn X VIP website. I just, yeah, I just did that. Oh, I didn't have to write it down. Okay, what I, what I did was better. I didn't need the game to do this for me. I just did it. I guess I'll do it again. Yep, that's what I came up with. Oh, hi, you Ashley. You are very observant. I agree. This could be the password to John's email. Let's break into his mailbox and find out his ultimate secrets. Okay. Let's do. The Tom Blanco Transfer Project to this. Okay, I can't click on it. Oh, I, yeah, I already seen that, but I couldn't collect it before anyway. Finally located the data. Quickly, hack into the servers and destroy everything. That would be illegal, Ashley. I would never do something like that. Okay, hacking. All oh, right, another part of my uh, favorite part of the game. All right, let's see if it's better this time at least. So we copy and paste an URL that we have. We get a series of letters and numbers and we enter them into a space directly below that then we <laughs> oh then we do he nothing. really is prepared this fan is more than meets the eye it's protected by the latest voice control combination law Okay, here's something new at least, I guess. I can use the company's big data to figure out the combination, but I need you to come up with the correct sound wave first. You can use the company's big data to figure out the combination. Your company is scary as fuck. And also, what do you mean the company's big data? What does, what does that even mean? Are you talking about you got some proprietary algorithms or something that's going to analyze, you know, I was going to say analyze vocal patterns or something like that. Like you have a vocal database or... You have like recorded telephone conversations with Van, and you're gonna just reassemble his vocal waveforms from those because that would that would be realistic and scary that you would have that information. But just saying, I can use the company's big data to figure out the combination. This is just using terms that, in a way that's completely meaningless. Like this is one of the things that's frustrating about all of this uh, with this game. It's like. It just says it's like it's got it's like it's got a list of like scary sounding tech words and it just picks them at random and assembles them into a word salad to come up with justifications for these plot devices. But it comes so close to actually doing something like if they just said that their company databases has they, they have recorded phone calls of this person who's known as Van. They don't know his identity, but they maybe know his uh, maybe they, 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 they knew his number, uh, and they recorded some calls and then they were able to analyze those calls. And now they're, they're basically analyzing all of the phone calls that they're, they're capturing. This is the big data aspect of it. 
and using the phone call they know that he made, they've been able to uh, reference other calls out of their data source, their data set, and now they have essentially a database of Van's calls. So they don't know his name, but they know his voice, essentially. And then they're going to use that data in order to essentially modulate a vocal waveform that they're going to uh, simulate his voice, right? Because they have the data to do that. That is viable. Well, it's possible and scary as hell that they would have that information. They'd be able to do that. And it's, there's enough verisimilitude. It's, it's plausible enough that that's all they had to do. They didn't have to just say, we're going to use the company's big data to figure out the combination. Voice control locks have a high level of precision. As a matter of fact, what they're having me do is kind of the exact thing that they should be having their technology doing. Um, all right, what am I supposed to be doing? Oh, okay, I see. Um, Sound wave matches the green sound. Oops. I wasn't quite ready to do that. I had the wrong button. Uh, 60 seconds. Okay. Um, file is too large. So enter name to retrieve keyword information. No data found. Uh, okay. Um, wait, fuck it. Come back to that information. I got is okay. Here's all the information that he was talking about sending assets. Denied. Tom Blanco. Upload. Uh, delete that. John's picture. Rendering. Security event. We see the edit. Config sys. Boot manager. Okay, so then it's just this. Can name. Um. Shit. Um. What? I will give you one more chance. Did I run out of time? I hope you will not let me down. Uh, I didn't realize I was out of time. 60 seconds went by fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck you. Great, now I gotta enter the shit again. All right, well, now that I know what I'm in for, it's asking for a name. And oh, I know what I did. Knowing this game, it has to be their full name. The first and uh, the first letter of the first and last name has to be capitalized. Oh, oh, sorry. I got this fucking brain buster of a, of a puzzle here, this hacking puzzle. Uh, let's see. Oh, what do I got to do? I, I, I think I need to get my black hoodie for this one. Where's my sunglasses? Oh, shit. Um, fuck. Uh, it's uh, uh, 83U24. Uh, okay, now I got to uh, cross-reference. Uh, uh, okay, we got to do a SQL injection attack. Okay, now I got to do some... Uh, cross site request forgery here uh kg uh god damn oh, you oh let's try it i'm in No, I'm a little off.
All right. Um, it's not banned. Ben Edwards. John Thompson. Um, Tom Blanco. Yeah, there it is. Uh, oh, wait. Shit. This is just this personal information. Um, uh, LC Cameron. Shit. Um, Did I misspell? Did I spell John with an H? I think I might have done so. Oh, I, I did. Okay, that's my bad. Um, there's a charge of this here. Fucking hell! I'm disappointed. My patience is gone. I'm I'm sorry, but what? You ask me to enter a name. I'm I'm furious right now. I'm furious. That this this is challenging for all the wrong fucking reasons, okay? Having an easy ass puzzle and then saying you have fucking no time to actually I like that I, I I even figured out the fucking puzzle. I just didn't have time to actually read what I was what I what was in front of me. You have only one chance left. Ashley, I'm gonna fucking kill you, I swear to God. This is not a challenge. This this is the puzzle equivalent of pointing at someone's shirt and telling them that they have some mustard on it and then flicking them in the nose when they look down. This is the puzzle equivalent of that. All right, we're going to go right for this now that I know the answer. Person in charge of the Starflower window secret to record videos against from the black belt. You would also see the Ailey Cameron. Here we have a list of names. Uh, okay. Miranda Cameron, her sister, who died. Uh, and then the other one was, uh, uh, fuck, uh, upload. So her sister killed herself because she was being well blackmailed you as completed well. completed your mission perfectly. Ashley. Praise from you is a bitter pill. It really is. What happens next is up to you. You may submit the information or continue to solve other mysteries. What a roller coaster ride this mission has been. Okay. We got to do hacking twice. The first time was actually good. The second time was terrible. Easy puzzles, but a short time span so that I didn't even have a ch I don't even, like, I barely have an idea of what that message said. And I entered the correct password immediately the second time. I suppose I had 40 seconds or so left on the clock, but it goes by so fucking fast. You know, I was rushing just to finish it to make sure I didn't fail again. And also, you know, I'm going to have to go back when this is up and I'm going to check the video, but I really feel like that was not 60 seconds. I feel like the clock stopped early both of those times, but hey, maybe that's just me. Uh, I really feel like I, it didn't go the whole 60 seconds, but uh, whatever. Um, so I got one name. Uh, out of that it was uh, it was Miranda um so um let's search for Miranda
Miranda Cameron this book. I can't collect any of her information. Okay. All right. Well, that uh, we got her tooth book, but that doesn't seem to do us any good. Um, is this new? Was this always here? During the last mission, there was a high talk fishing icon here. Now it says positioning. What's this? Welcome to OEMC, which stands for City Emergency Surveillance and Communication System, the pride <laughs> of Titan. <laughs> How does OEMC stand for City Emergency Surveillance and Communication System? It should be C E S C S. Uh, Keskis. Keskis, eh? This system can track down suspicious targets through surveillance cameras located in cities all over Olivia. It's an important weapon used to maintain peace in Olivia. Dude, Titan is the villain here. Titan is the bad guy. Or is, are the bad guys. OEMC can recognize any target on a picture. There is no hiding from the surveillance as the system will display the target's recent whereabouts and locations on the map. So it's a facial recognition system. You may use the system to find out where the target has visited. I hope this will be helpful. Good luck. Ooh, Titan is scary. You guys are the bad guys. Ashley, I hope you're the final boss. I hope you're the final boss. And when you get to hell, tell them Poppy Pie sent you there. Deep scan required. Okay. Okay. Okay, so it's fine then. Doop, doop. Ah, oh, should I missed it? Well, I mean, this is this is a new thing. I'm I'm excited about it. I mean, it, this is it's you no, know, you know what? Now that I think of it, this is kind of it's not a puzzle. I'm just hitting a button at the right time. Um, it's a nice change of pace. We haven't done something like this, I guess. Oh, OEMC Office of Emergency Management Communications. That's what she meant the acronym stands for, not the system itself. So that's just a grammatical thing. All right, he's at Mullen Road at the top of the hill. Hopefully he's about to throw himself off into the sea. I just received word that John was in a car accident at Mullen Road and died after falling off a cliff. Oh, cool. Thank God. He was last seen at the entrance to Mullen Road at 5.50 a.m. The circumstances of his death raise all kinds of conspiracy theories. It's quite unexpected. Eh, he was a piece of shit. Let's not bother looking into it too much. Uh, we're finally getting those email records. Elise's, uh, Elsie's, I keep saying Elise, Elsie's recorded call. Dear, I'm very shocked after hearing this news. But I'm even more concerned about the state you're in. I won't feel at ease if you're all alone in this apartment. Thanks, Sophia. <sighs> to be honest, 
I was going Please to don't. kill that demon last night to end this nightmare. God, your thoughts are deluded. Damn it. Thank don't God spell it out. Do it. Don't spell no. it out. I plan to find a solution online. To cut off the half of the brakes cable, but ultimately, I didn't do it like that. Yes, I didn't do it like that. Elsie. Don't ruin yourself by sinning. My life is a complete mess now. I dare not leave the house anymore. I dare not look those in the eye who've mocked me. I don't even know how to spend the rest of my life. Believe me, everything will improve for you in time. I'm here to look out for you. I've got your back. But what can I do about those pictures? Things will only get better. Don't look back, Elsie. You need to keep busy doing other things to take your mind off this. <sighs> yeah, you're right. But I just feel nothing but pain. Darling, I'm here to look after you. Mason... Haven't the seniors been recruiting for a place, female lead? You should go for it. It will help you boost your confidence. <sighs> Sorry. I don't feel like I'm in the right frame of mind for it. Look, you need to take the step forward. You don't want to fall behind forever, right? Um... <sighs> take a good rest for now. I'll come and find you in the afternoon. Okay. I don't like that. That was dumb. We know that Sophia is involved in this and uh, Mason's involved in this. It would have been so much better if the scenario had just ended with, oh, John's dead from a car accident. Who knows how that might have happened? And then just leaving the fact that so that Elsie actually did it completely up to us to figure out and then moving on with the scenario in a different direction a as it is. This isn't whatever it would have, been, it would have been better, but lost opportunities. I'm being left with the feeling like I feel every time I watch an MCU movie these days, which is just, boy, that could have been better. Uh, do we have uh, any new um, mail messages about the death or uh, news? Uh, new update on the controversy associated with my history Modi's ex-wife Lisa, a lawyer. She admitted being married multiple times. Blah 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 blah. VIP recently was reported that a well-known matchmaking website has been why they shut down as a VIP service. Okay. Titan announced that it had success. Yeah, see, this is the fucking world right here. Titan is the bad guy. Um. Okay. Is there any more? Where what are we at here? Ninety one percent. I don't know what else to do. Was there something Dear, in that? Oh, please don't. I'm very shocked after hearing this news. I just, I just no. I just wanted to know if there was something. Dear, okay, I'm just quick. I'm very shocked after hearing this news. But I'm even more concerned about the state you're in. I won't feel at ease if you're all alone in this apartment. Thanks, Sophia. Okay, no. Um. I think I'm ready to end this. We're not done, but honestly, I'm sunflower seed flavored. Okay. Um. I think I'm done. I don't. I don't think I can. I think we're good. We're so close, but at the same time, let's try searching for. Sunflower seed whiskey. 
Um, I don't know what else to do. Oh, what else do we do? All right, whatever. This is optional anyway. Oh, shit, we're only missing one? One piece of information? Okay, it's only one. Oh my god. One piece of information. One clue. One clue. Ah, uh, I can't believe we didn't collect anything on on this site. It's got to be on this one, right? Why would there be this site if there was nothing to collect on it? Fine tooth comb this shit. I mean, there's a lot of information on this page that looks like it would be relevant. We got a name. Classmate took me to a bar with sunflower, uh, sunflower seed whiskey. And that's it. No, there's nothing for us to collect. Um, well, I went through this guy's thing kind of fast. Maybe it's on here. One thing. There's one thing. Damn it. I just realized I missed a meeting. Julie. Really hate to leave this with just one. Hold on, I gotta add a call here. Ooh. All right, I don't know where this fucking last thing is. <laughs> Uh, 
Uh, this is what is so annoying about this game mechanic. This is what's so annoying about this game mechanic. You have to click on the thing in order to collect it. It's clearly not important. I understand that. Fuck it. I don't fucking care. Mission completed successfully. How are you feeling? Frustrated. Just doing my job. Happy to be of use for the company. Or piece of cake, it's nothing major. Ashley, I don't like you. I don't like Titan. And I don't know why I'm doing these things uh, just willingly. I'm, I'm a fucking tool. This game puts you in the shoes of a fucking tool. You know, you know what a tool is? You know? I'm not talking about a tool tool. I'm talking about somebody who is used willingly. I am a useful idiot in this game. This game makes you a tool. Ugh. Oh, Whatever. what a cocky guy. Fuck you. What are your thoughts on the spy camera incident? <laughs> Obviously, John and Mason did something unethical and illegal. What John and Mason did was despicable. Their action will cause serious damage to the whole society. If the law cannot bring John and Mason to justice, then let them be judged by vigilantes. Why give me three options that are exactly the same? What about Elsie? What are your thoughts on her? The situation is very bad. I feel bad for her, what a poor girl, or she was too weak and has herself to blame. So if you were Elsie, what would you do? I would hack the hotel's entire system, I would call the police immediately, I would kill John. I mean, she should have called the police immediately. Oh, that's unexpected. Is it? Is it? Okay, I get your point. I'll find you when the next mission comes. <sighs> All right, we got those, we got those, we got those. Investigate crimes committed against females. I also found the John Seagull. There's more than one of those. I think I was experiencing the same thing. Maybe there was another name on the list in the in the server that I could have grabbed. I saw Miranda's name on there and then I saw that it was highlighted and I clicked on it. And then I left immediately because I didn't want to end up um, you know, getting uh, screwed again for the third time. So there probably was another name on there for me to investigate and I just didn't couldn't collect it. Didn't collect it. So um that's where I'm guessing the last piece of information was. Just stab in the dark. Boy, should I do another part on this? I tell you, this game is profoundly frustrating. Um, after the first mission, I was like, you know what? This game might actually be pretty good. Maybe I didn't give it a fair shot. You know, the tutorial level sucked, but hey, it's a tutorial level. The first mission was good. Let's do the next mission, and it'll be good too. And then then I can say that Cyber Manhunt is one of those games where you just got to give it a little bit of time, and, and it comes around. But I tell you, the second mission I is frustrating as hell uh there were times when there wasn't enough information but like this game 99 percent of the time there's too much information uh the fucking uh uh people talking like anime characters the voice acting uh the nonsense uh this is fucking frustrating maybe i'll do a part four maybe how many missions are in this Son of a bitch, anyway. Um, I definitely don't want to play again. Oh, uh, God. And there's DLC for this, too. Fuck. There's, uh, there's the, the, um, Company Man of Titan, which was a free DLC, but there's also Hello World and Home Sweet Home, which are paid DLC. Um, I don't know, man. Maybe I'll do another part. I'm on the fence about it because this could be such a good game. This is one of the things why it's so frustrating. This could be such a good game, but the fucking good game gets in the way or the, the bad part get in whatever. There's so many negatives about it that prevent it from being good. I really want to know what that last piece of information I missed is. 
I'm not going to go look up a guide. I'm not going to do it. I refuse. I refuse to go look up a guide on this. Whatever. Okay, maybe I'll be back. Maybe I won't. I don't know. Fucking Cyberman hunt. <laughs>